Hi guys, I'm gonna do a Jeffrey Campbell shoe collection video right now because I'm moving and this is gonna be my moving special night because I'm moving all my crap out of my room and I figure I'll just film all my shoes while I'm at it because why not? I'm moving them anyway. Ah. I have uh, 28 pairs I believe. No, I don't have the biggest collection like on the whole internet or anything because I know Pink Kitten has like 300 pairs or something crazy and I'm sure there's other people who have a lot of pairs but this might be the biggest documented on video Jeffrey Campbell shoe collection. We'll see. I'm not sure, but it's pretty impressive, guys. I was kidding. But I'm going to um, film them all for you right now. These are actually all my shoes stacked up. As you can see, there's quite a few of them. I'm going to have some of them out of their boxes just because, I guess. I don't know. These are the Jeffrey Campbell backstage. These are one of my first pairs of Jeffrey Campbell shoes. They're the Jeffrey Campbell uniform. I think these are the only pair of flats I have by him. I don't know, I'm just not doing expensive flats, even though I wear flats more than anything. I just don't like paying a lot of money for them. I don't know why. I'm stupid. These are the Jeffrey Campbell Michelle and closed toe. I don't know, I really liked the Michelle heels back in the day. I thought they were really cute. And they always have a they always had a peep toe, which I don't really like peep toes. But then I saw these for sale and I ended up getting them. These are the Jeffrey Campbell Copen. I don't know, these are cute. I like them, but they're kind of ankle breakers for me just because of the lack of ankle support. As you can see, they end, you know, right below your ankles. These are the Pixie in white leather. I'm trying to kind of go in order with these. So as you can see, these have definitely a lower heel. As time has gone on, his styles have gotten higher and higher. These are my blue velvet Litas. These are still one of my favorite pairs. These are the first pair of Litas I ever bought, actually. I got these off Nasty Gal. I think they actually restocked these on Soulstruck. So if you like these, I would definitely recommend them. They're beautiful royal blue velvet. These are Lita's and American flag print. I really love these. These were the second pair of shoes that were I got off Nasty Gal. I got these like a week after the Blue Velvet ones because I love the Blue Velvet ones so much. But yeah, I really like these. Only thing I don't like is the white gets dirty pretty easily, which sucks. But These are the Lita harness and black ostrich leather, leather, meaning the leather has like raised bumps all over it. I don't know. I really like these. I'm a retard, you guys. I just put a... Uh, I put these on and off like three different times because I kept forgetting you have to put the harness on your leg before you put the shoe on or else you can't get it over your shoe. So like, yeah, I'm stupid. These are pretty intense. I got these off Carmel a long time ago. I really don't know. I don't think these are even around anymore. These are the Giggle Tick by Jeffrey Campbell. I really like these. I don't know. They're just kind of crazy. Everybody calls these my stripper shoes, but I just think they're awesome. They have like uh, leather going all the way up your leg, slashed up, and like the studded... Heel. So that's pretty cool. These are my blue tardies. Really like these. I like the tardies a lot. Really cool looking shoes. These are the Jeffrey Campbell Expelled. I love these. If you don't, get out of my life. I'm just kidding, but I love them. Awesome. Knee high, killer kick ass boots. I really like the hooks on these and the way the boots like. Lace up, I don't know, they're cool. They have like regular holes and then also these hooks, so awesome. These are my Lita's in white glitter. Very shiny, shimmery. I actually haven't worn these yet because the glitter hurts my ankle, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that, but I got them for like $50 on Black Friday weekend, so. These are my Jeffrey Campbell Lana's. These were the follow up to the Lita, and I don't know, I guess they just kind of scrapped it because they really didn't do as well, and I don't think they don't seem to be coming out with any new ones. Um, I like these, but I do prefer the Lita just because, I don't know. Bronte in black with uh, velvet, and it's got like a floral pattern on it. I really like these very Victorian looking, old fashioned, pretty. Uh, I like these. These are the Bronte in tan with navy patent leather. These were like 50 bucks on Nasty Gal, and I like the look of the shoe, so I was like, hell yeah. So yeah, it's um... Stinger in black patent with studs. This is the longest video of my life, you guys. <laughs> These are awesome. Creepers, easy to walk in. Yeah. Tardy in black, same as the Tardy in blue, except for black. Damsel in black crushed velvet. Kind of hard to see any detail on them, but they have all the detail of the regular damsels. They have the little stitching up the back. I don't know, I like these. I like to call these my Frankenstein shoes just because look how they look. They look like Frankenstein feet. I don't know. These are my Nightwalk in Black Suede, my first pair of Nightwalks. I like these. When these came out, I just had to have them, so here they are. 
a little big because I got my regular size, but whatever. Croc leather, the natural. I like these. Uh, I got these in a seven and a half, so they fit better than the black suede pair I have. Yeah, these are just cool. You can see that. These are my Lita's in Green Crush Velvet. They have a black heel, very beautiful jewel tone, like emerald green. I love these. These are my Slytherin shoes. If I went to Hogwarts and I was in Slytherin, I would wear these. No, They're badass, though. One of my favorite pairs. These are the Revel in Black Suede. Kind of hard to walk in, but awesome. So, I don't know. I like these. If you like crazy-ass shoes, check them out. I think they're on sale right now. On Sestra. And nasty guy. These are my Lita Spikes in red leather. These are kind of loose. I don't know if you people should order a half size down on these or what, but I ordered my regular size and they're really loose, so I don't know. I've worn them out. Some asshole spilled their drink all over them, so they kind of have some shit on them, but whatever. Here they are. These are the Shadow Stud. I love these. Everybody loves these when I wear these. They're awesome, comfortable, really cool. Uh, order a half size up. They run small. Sting Spike, awesome, but super heavy, even heavier than the Shadow. Um, I haven't worn them out yet. I'm probably going to wear them in the winter, I think. They're not really a summer shoe, so, yeah, but these are awesome. Got them for, like, 40 bucks on Karma Loop. Sweet deal. These are my Night Leaders. I also got these really cheap on Karma Loop for, like, 40 bucks. These are on sale on Nasty Guy right now for, like, $100, which is half off, so if you like these, I would get them. They're awesome. I wore them out the other night, no problems, although I did fall and scuff the back of the heel pretty bad, but oh well. It was raining and I ate shit off a curb. <laughs> these are the Razor in black suede with silver stars. These are crazy. These are the ones with the 7 inch heel and the 3 inch platform. I haven't worn these out yet either just because they're, I don't know, pretty wild, make me super tall. And yeah, check them out. They're pretty awesome. Ah, I just almost ate shit. Check them out. They're pretty awesome. Uh, got these for cheap on Karma as well, like 60 bucks. Last pair, woohoo, I feel like I just ran the marathon of shoes. Uh, these are the Nightwalk Spike in patent leather. Got these on Carmel Loop for like 40 bucks as well. These are awesome, really like them. Pretty. Check them out, yeah. Um, okay, that was my Jeffrey Campbell shoe collection. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I am not rich, just so you all know. I'm just a really good shopper. Out of all those shoes, I probably paid full price for like five pair, not even that. I really hate buying my shoes at full price, so I got almost all those on sale. So yeah, I'm just an awesome online shopper. I'm not like some money bags buying like $200 shoes all the time. Most of these I got for under $100, some even for less than $50. So yeah, thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. Have a great day. I hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you.